I'm here. And I am closing things so we can move a little faster. Ooh, faster. What's up, cat face? Anybody want a cat? And especially an annoying one? There's one available to you if you would like it. All right, while this is loading, I'm going to plug in my headset so I can actually hear what's going on. Oh dear, I hate it when I can't figure out which way the U. This is going to be one of those days I can already tell. Better watch your tail hair. Good morning. <clears throat> I'm just starting. Literally just bo booting up EU. So there's a good chance no one's on yet. Uh, let me put on pretzel rocks. <laughs> I am a breakfast burrito. Here we are. All right, we're over on EU because I think that's where we should be. But I could be wrong. Big houses, big houses, no whammies. Faces Blackwood Chapel. Talk about big. I made this house as my second primary and as a mini guild hall of a sort. Good morning. Role play setting for my friends. The theme wraps around a magic school in Leywin. You're much, very, you're much welcome to visit and engage in activities here. Okay. Um, what was I going to say to you guys? still pretty tired today but I lost a viewer yesterday I don't know who but my numbers dropped down by one and it's like you know I guess that's just a sign I can't really take the day off <laughs> what do I know not much not much yeah I'm surprised So, uh, they're up to the costume contest uh, in Oblivion for uh, ESO Rocks Out. And uh, we're bringing heavy metal to ESO fashion, put together a signature Oblivion inspired look, and share it with us using hashtag ESO Rocks Out for a chance to win. We'll draw three winners on September 16th. Now, you could do whatever you want practically because. It's being picked randomly. So it doesn't really matter what you do. I suggest you put something together that looks black and scary and go for it. I mean, what else do you need to do? <laughs> Would you rather fight one dragon-sized guar or 100 guar-sized dragons? 
I think both would be terrifying. Doesn't it, though? That was how we felt about the uh, housing contest. Uh, exactly, and they started with a two-day housing contest, which was equally random. Hello! So, who knows? You don't have a uh, Twitter? Don't eat me. I'm not for the eatings. This is Fox Faces. Uh... <clears throat> what? Chapel. I, I think I'll change me to not be a burrito so you don't eat me. None. It's all lies. I'll be a druid. I'm a druid! Hello. So, outside, we've got... The blacksmith. All sorts of, like, uh, the wood crafting, which is back here. Well, no one said you have to participate in it. You just have to start a, an account and... Um, and then post a picture. I am on it, um, but mostly for my notifications when I go live. Oh, look how pretty. But I also... Um, I used to be more active politically, and it was a good way to get information quickly. But obviously not now. It's not as important. Oh look, they, they're cleaning the clothes with a brush. Yeah, potatoes open, go for it. I'm so tired. I'm sorry guys, I'm, I'm useless today. I wasn't gonna stream, but I have to because I missed yesterday, somebody unfollowed, and that sucks. Cause I mean, every follower is super important to me right now, and I'm doing the best that I can. And, oh, look at that, that's smart. I don't know what's wrong with me. I uh, I was I thought I overate yesterday because everything was so swollen. You know when you feel like distended or whatever, because you feel like you ate too much. My friggin' house is being eaten again. But it's not. It's me. My uh, my engagement slash wedding ring does not fit right now. Uh, this glove is cutting off my circulation. There's just all sorts of weird stuff going on. Here's the school. Anybody want a free uh, woodpecker? Come and get it. Sewing room. No, this is for um, typing to make sure that I don't. Uh, it's got a bean bag. Seen? It's a wrist guard. It's got a uh, bean bag underneath so that you don't put your wrist in the wrong direction and hurt yourself. I have a thing about. Uh, I have a thing. This I've been using these for like twenty years, and they're great. Um, they really work to avoid hurting yourself. I use it every day. Whoa. What? Oh, I walked into a fireplace. Whoopsie doodle. Aww. 
I would love to get another kitty, but my husband is adamantly against it. To put it mildly. I don't know why this isn't opening. I thought this would open. Anybody want a free uh, woodpecker? Anyone? Do you hear it? It's hard to miss. Hello! Say hello to my little woodpecker. Oh, here's the uh, potions class. Makes many soups is cooking back here. I think that's all we're going to be able to do. I know I saw the transmute machine upstairs, but I don't know that there's a way to get to it. Oh, rogue the Samothrace! He's been a while. Hello, Samo. Okay, next. Let's go to another big one. Moon sugar. Who's the oldest moon sugar? It would be one of these two. CBK7, lore inspired. Let's go. Hmm. Hello. Would you rather fight one dragon-sized guar or 100 guar-sized dragons? I don't know the answer. You tell me. making funny faces at you guys yeah I was thinking that myself we might have a chance I don't think you'd have a chance with a with a giant guar because if it's like the guar world boss you're screwed that's a good point Oh, all right. War are the best. <clears throat> all right. How many items do we have here? 407. We're not we're not complete, but maybe we are for a non ESO plus. So, good morning, all thumbs. Uh, we've got. I don't know if you guys. Oh, look at this. So pretty. Are going to enter J Hart's contest, but J Hart has really open ended contests this month. It is for, oh, maybe it is not done. Um, it is for gardens. You can open up a house for gardens. This does not look done to me. This could be in progress, but we'll take a quick look. Um, so I suggest you enter. We all got gardens, right? Um, and then the other one that's going on is the words, the Ouroboros, I believe. Is it Ouroboros? Let me double check. No, ESO Housing Network is doing a decorate a wave shrine contest. Very small. Seems to me like it would be good to enter. If you want to get some experience, like you said, work in progress. I'll go to a different one. All right. Uh, la, la, la. Lynchel. Let's go to Nebs. Whoa, 666 days. Equestrian Center. Here is the information on the ESO Housing Network contest. I'm linking it. 
in case you wish to enter that. Good morning! Um, I'm also going to put it in my Discord. Ongoing contests. If I can get my Discord to open up. Why, you don't think you'll be in the top 16? You, I, I've seen your work. Your work is excellent. I would be surprised if you weren't. I mean, he's got us. I think this is the this is the compromise. I think between between him doing it, not doing housing contests. He doesn't. I'm sorry to hear that. Because I love you, and that makes me really sad. Six ninety-seven out of seven hundred. There's very few people that I don't care for their work. Very few. Uh, usually it's just people who don't try. Oh, really? I'm sorry to hear that. I love it, and I love you. So, gosh, that makes me want to cry. I'm sorry. I'm just trying to come up with options for you guys to you know, come up with creative ideas. Hey, Masha! And and feel like you can share them with the community, but I don't encourage you to hurt yourself with someone who... or something that isn't a positive experience for you, so don't feel bad about that. Look at the... I'm thinking they used Kalanda or Varla. I always forget what color is which. And they built this entire friggin' castle over here. Look at this madness. This is great, Neb. I love it. It's beautiful. Not entirely sure how they made that arch. This must be just two curved walls. Wow. Yeah, you are very loved, and so is your work, so don't feel bad about that he's not he is the OG he is my friend um, he has done a lot of nice things to promote me um, he is the reason why I stream um, housing because um, he inspired me to do it uh, there have been things that I don't agree with him about, but that's true of everything and everyone. You know, we don't all agree on everything. But, you know, you got to give props where props are due, and he was definitely my inspiration. So, you know, I, I think he does a lot for the community. Nobody's perfect. Certainly not me. Add me to that list right at the top. What do I know? Not much. Look at how pretty this whole house is. It's like they built a separate house. Oh, that's the bed. Check that out. Yeah. And I like this. Um, they used that topper from elsewhere. This is so pretty. Speaking of, this reminds me I was going to put some more ginkgo trees in a house I'm working on. <laughs> yeah, believe it or not, this is Lunchel. Neb. Neb is super talented, though. This is so Neb. Oh my goodness, they built one on the other side, too. Excuse me. Little details, cute stuff. Ponies walking around. Somebody likes ponies. Oh my goodness, there's so much to this house. They must have closed off the main house. All right, I'm not entirely sure how they made that. I see a 
That's a sarcophagus. I believe that's a bed. Um, hold on. I'm changing this to lighter. If you can't hear something or if there's a weird noise, let me know. Um, two paintings. At least. Maybe more. I can't do that. Another bedroom back here with a really cool fireplace, the likes of which I have never seen. This is wild. It never occurred to me to build a whole nother house, but you've got so much space in this house, it does make sense. Look at the boxes here. The window boxes. I bet you this was made before... Yeah, this is 666 days old. This was made before we had window boxes. Oh my goodness. There is so much going on in here. Well, you gotta do what matters to you. And if it's not winning, if it's more about being true to your art, then don't worry about it. Just do, just enter it and be you. Yeah, I think I don't like... Okay, so I'll be honest. I don't like this new turn of being more picky. But he's got to do what he's got to do to make money on his stream. And I give him credit for that. Um, it's not what I would do. Oh, look at this cute little alcove. But there's a lot of things that I do that he wouldn't do, I'm sure. You know? We're different people. Uh, so I give him credit for where it is due, and I like him. I, I do consider him a friend. I'm not going to go bad-mouthing him or telling him, hey, guess what people thought of you, you know, and say all sorts of bad things. That's not like me. Um, but I will say that I wish he would go back to the way he was, where he was more uh, willing to look at everybody's stuff, not just some things. All right, let's go underwater to Selena Sarah's Mundus Domus Magica. And I'm going to turn the temperature down just a tad. I'll be right back. It's hard, though, because like, all of us are a little bit on the sensitive side, including myself. I remember when uh, someone reviewed one of my houses. It was the first house that I ever had it toured. And actually, I wasn't... A I was asked, but I never said yes. So they just went to it and toured it. And... They went off on this tangent about something in the house that was not meant to be anything important. It was just, I had used something for fire. It was like the, that remains of the Balrog or whatever the hell it was. Um, was that you saying? I don't remember. My memory is shot. Was that the one talking about going to your potentates? Because we went to that yesterday. Uh, it should be on the video. Not yesterday, two days ago. Sorry about the breathing. I'm trying to get this out of the way. Um, and I admit, I was hurt at first. It was not my idea of, you know, why are you even paying attention to that? 
Oh, I'm on EU today, but I can take a look at it tomorrow. Crazy. All right, here we are. 476 out of 700, Selena Sarah. Whoa. This must be a glorious house of, of all the things that this person has achieved. Oh, you're welcome. I think you inspired people in a lot of ways. Why does this seem like sunlight here? What am I... What light are you using that looks like sunlight? I think this part's under construction. I'm just keep on hitting these under construction houses. Anyway, point being, we're all sensitive. I took it really poorly. And, uh... It made me not want to submit my houses. But I got over it. And I submitted them again. And he's been about half and half. About half of my builds he's just like, meh. And then half of them he likes. So, go figure. I, d I don't know. It's okay. Not everyone has to like your stuff. It's true. I will look at everything and enjoy everything. Although sometimes I don't say it. Like right now I'm sucking at the at the saying things out loud. I've seen people turn this entire thing into a tree. They're kind of using it like that here. Oh, you are good enough. But you can turn these into a tree and it's really cool looking. Oh, I almost missed the little... There's a little, uh... I think that's Sithis. I think it's, you know, you gotta be picky. I used to do them all. I don't know where I got the imagination for it. So do I. It's the story of my life. That's why this stream exists. Because I used to snoop in everybody's houses and then just decided to do a stream of it. Ah! Dead person. I think it's almost like it's them collecting stuff. It's like all of their things they're putting in one place. Nothing wrong with that. It's just... Whoa, what's up there? What have we done here? That looks like a little house. A little Argonian house. Maybe they're testing how t high up they can go. You know, it's it's not even the equipment and the time. It's just, it's figuring it out. It, you would think it'd be simple, but it isn't. I spent a lot of time watching videos, asking for help. And even after asking for help, I still didn't understand. I had to watch more videos. It's just one of those things where, um, I'm gonna die if I do this. Um, where there's a learning curve to it, for sure. And some people have been asking me for help with it. And I do my best to help people, but... It's just... I find it's not something I can easily teach people. Mainly because I don't fully understand it myself. I, uh... I've got it working for me. But I don't understand how all of it works. Yeah, the mic would probably be a good idea, but mics are cheap. If you get a normal mic, it could come on your webcam. Um, it doesn't have to be a super expensive mic. Like some, some streamers really invest in the equipment before they even start streaming. And it's like, well, you don't even know if you're going to like it. So I would buy cheaper equipment to begin with. See if you like it. 
this is really unique. Uh, all these structural areas that are not normally here, and then building up. Thank you. Well, I hope that, that we both set the tone for the community. I mean, if he wants to be more particular, I mean, I'm sure there's... I mean, you got to remember, this is his is a business. Mine isn't. Mine is for just because I, I like to do it and I like houses and I love you guys. That's all it is. Um, his is, you know, he doesn't have a job outside of this. This is what he does. And he needs to make money somehow. Personally, I would never put myself in that position again. I would want to... Look at all the statuary up there, too. I tend to... Uh, I mean, I have a real, quote-unquote, real job. It's a research job, but... Let's go to... Uh, that's it. Just a werewolf tree, Jack Blackbone. Or not. Yep. But it's it's putting statues out there. Hall of the Luna Champion. Let's do Megalunin signs. Khajiit Home Deluxe. I would love to get... Hey, Andy. Do you think you could get the uh, air blowing through here? It's 60-something outside, and it's... Maybe put the fan on it back there? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Sorry. It's hot in here. I'm asking Mr. Potato to help out. It's getting hot in here. Um, I would love to have another job. But as I get sicker... I used to be so proud of being an attorney. Now, not so much. I want Zoss to hire me. Alright. But I am not young and healthy. So I cannot... Oh, look at this. So six ninety nine out of seven hundred. This is like Khajiit home. <laughs> this morning, DDA was talking about um, someone in DDA was talking about those uh, scuttle blooms that they're selling for like ninety to one hundred k a piece on NA. So if you want to make some money, go hunting some scut scuttle blooms and put them out for sale. I don't know. It's it's I think I just most of the time I'm leeching off the hubby I'm okay with that, but sometimes I wish I had something like that in still in my life. No, 90 to 100 ish is what I was reading or hearing. So, this is like a Khajiit's home away from home. Or maybe it's not away from home. I'll stop the music if it's buffering. Okay. Okay. Don't 
Okay. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Yeah, somebody was saying that they bought one at 30k, but that they're all on TTC for a lot more. I mean, it's just another way to make money. But the more consistent and reliable way of making money is fishing. For sure. Look at this cute little area with the with the lanterns and everything. Somebody made a personal paradise is what I think they did. Is that you, old man? That is. Little Miss is like, what the hell? What are you doing here? Because he's usually asleep by now. He gets up in the morning, he annoys his dad, and then he goes back to sleep under the bed for a few hours. But it looks like he just finished eating, and then he came in here and he jumped in the window, and she's like, oh, what? Why are you here? <laughs> Cracks me up. You leave him alone and let him look out the window, too. He's just as entitled as you are to get the sniffs. I'll tell you something, though. I really want a cat. Oh, let me show you the cat I really, really want. And my husband won't let me get. Hopefully she got adopted already. What is it, buddy? Okay. Go back under the bed, then. Yeah. Here we go. On this, I was, uh, I would love to get Stormy, is her name. Oh, pretty. Got all sorts of glowies. Glowies! No effects, so those are torch bugs. My husband's telling me to be aware if it starts storming, but it's storming in the game, so it's kind of hard to tell. Crafting room. Isn't she pretty? She's so pretty. This must be Mists of the Hagfin. And this is all their scary stuff in one place. I gotcha. Hello. I'm here. No, um, looks like they closed off the last room. Very, um, Khajiiti, like you said. Mm, my top. Thank you, Turbo Sheepy. What a cute name. Aw, that's adorable. A place that invites you to dream. Maya Fushi, Grand Topo. That was very nice of you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Is it still lagging? I have been better. I am not well, but I'm holding up. I'm holding on for you guys. Holding on. Mm. 
now it just needs some more followers. <laughs> it's true. But there's a lot of different options for it. You know what I mean? Jelly bean? into the music I'm gonna have to move my rock stage oh back over to a different section because it, it doesn't really look right there Maya Fushi oh wow wow oh I love when people put their boats way out there Fell runner. Fell running. Doo -doo 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 -doo. It runs away. I would love to not have a giant thunderstorm, but um, heck rat! Look, they built a raft. How cute is that? Oh, and they're fishing for pearls. Actually, you would be diving for pearls on the dumbass. Where are you going, pack rats? I would love to get a job, um, another online job. If only another part-time one, you know? That's pretty. I wonder what's going on in here other than a bonfire. Maybe it's starting a bigger bonfire. It almost looks like they're building another ship. Can you not? Whatever you're doing, just not. Look at these cool lights. 687 out of 700. This is another house, though, that you gotta be careful with because... <clears throat> You can fill it up, and it can still feel pretty empty, because there is... It's true. Not that I'm saying that it feels empty, because there's plenty of stuff here up in the front. What I'm saying is, is that you gotta be careful as you're building it to not... Uh, ignore sections unless you actually don't plan on using them, in which case you should block them off. Look at this. Nami's. This is the feast section. Very pretty. And here we sit outside and dine. Reminds me of my honeymoon. Oh, they did fill everything. Okay, cool. Is this a shop? Or... S I'm assuming it's a shop. Sorry, I was, I was trying to deal with the music there. And whatever the hell was going on with it. There's something down there. This house gives me so much. I just don't know what to do with it.
Right now I've been using it as a staging ground for housing. Like I'll build it something on that on the island and then move it to somewhere else. Lots of extra privacy in here. I see. Ooh, painting um, an artist studio. really well lit in the different sections and then this is like a tiki bar over here that's some good ideas if you want to build like a cool uh, beach tent I really like the idea of using the Reachman stuff and the reeds that looks good Now, what makes me sad about this house is that I would want to use everything from here on over, and I really can't. Especially the lava. And it won't let you. Ooh! Let's go to Sandrar's... Wait, did we do a Sandrar yet? No. Museums and exhibits. Yeah, it's been stormy. Yeah, something, but for Argonians, it seems. a really weird sixth sense about when people are going to die. You cannot. You can build over tiny little bits at the bottom, but that's it. And it's like I worry about things, and then I'll tell him I'll tell Andy, you know, you should really call this person, or you really should deal with this thing, because I don't know that this person's going to be around much longer. And then they'll in both cases, they died the next day. Really freaky. And one of them was unexpected, for sure. This is 656 out of 700, and it is a museum. One was his friend was, was 41 when she passed and I just had a feeling and uh, it was like it happened in her sleep it wasn't like she did anything and then the other one was his aunt who just passed and I we knew she had stage 4 cancer but she had had it for months and I said to him you know you really need to call her because you know, it's getting close to what I think would be the end, and then she passed the next day. It's weird. Freaky. It's gotten to the point where I almost don't want to say anything. Look at the baskets with the lights in them. That's beautiful, Sandrar. 
Oh my gosh, I'm totally stealing this idea. How beautiful. I can't turn this one on though. You need to come and turn your, your candle on. Will you light my candle? Sorry, rent. He did. He did indeed. It's true. There was not suicide in either case, though. One was stage four cancer, and the other one was she died in her sleep. But yeah, I agree with you. It has been hard times. And I think we got to be there for each other. This is quite beautiful. I wonder, I mean, I know that we're going with museum, but it's, it's so pretty on the outside. I always think of like museums as inside things, but I guess they're not, they can be outside too. I could just have a ton of this particular house and just do something different in it for each one. Cooks without a recipe! Yesterday, speaking of cooking, mm, look at that. We made a uh, queso, fake, fake vegan queso, and then we made a... Uh, The name slips in my mind. It's those cornbread type dealies. Mexican cornbread type things. I forget what they're called, but I made a pie of those. We made a pie of those. And it was neat. Tamales. We made a tamale pie. Ah, I see the I see the museum -y in bit in here. It's like a whole restaurant. You should invite your guild over and, and do RP in here. RP a restaurant evening. So is this where the curator lives? Very romantic. I know, I have the same, oh yes. Your wedding build was spec frickin' tacular. Oh, they closed this off. Um, and then, and this too, okay. Yeah, it's a queso, it's a cashew based one. Cashews and nooch and uh, you know, herbs and miso and all the bit. The typical, the usual. Nothing really unusual in it for uh, vegan. All right, let's go to, I think, uh, medium-sized ones. Let's go to medium-sized ones, because medium and small. Black Razor's Redder and Home Amaya. Black Razor is usually really ridiculously good. Um, I follow a recipe set from a woman called... Um, I always get the name wrong. 
dirty girl clean mm. eating or something clean food dirty girl clean food or something like that I just, I used to subscribe yeah yep it's because um hey Salvis um it's because the cashews are essentially oil I mean that's what they they when you cook them or, or heat them to a point, they just become an oil substance. So if you put an oil substance in with nooch, which tastes like cheese, and then you put in a thickener of some sort and you cook it, it uh, essentially becomes a cheese. You just have to add other flavors into it too to make it more complex a flavor than just nooch. But you get the idea. Exactly. It's a... Uh, they're a really good ingredient in a lot of things. And then we used it, the queso, in our um, tamale pie, along with lime rice and pinto beans and veggies and a cornbread topping. So that'll, that should be a good recipe. I can't cook alone anymore, though. That's the sad part because of... Um, my my problems my physical problems i need him to cut things up and whatnot i've learned more about cooking since i started cooking vegan than i ever did before 598 out of 600 this is black razor Ooh, they did a lot of fun stuff um i'm not by no means am i fully vegan i just do a lot of vegan cooking because oddly enough whoa what's going on here uh, believe it or not, I actually like it. And I do lose weight when I'm eating fully vegan. So there's that. Um, whoa. What is going on in here? This is crazy. I like it. And of course, the cornbread, we used uh, applesauce and not oil. We don't use oil in our cooking. So, all of the oil is typically, you know, coming from the food itself. But then, you know, on Fridays, I'll eat, like, delivery pizza. So, you know, I'm by no means holier than thou. Look at the little, uh... Target dummies. They're cute as buttons. I know some pe targets and the little mist things. That's adorable. People are throwing targets and they miss. Oh my god, I gotta take a screen of that. But maybe it's time to go fully vegan again because I'm just feeling so disgusting lately. Ooh, that is a good idea, sinking the Dwarmer fountain in and put other things in there so it looks like they're attached to it. Ciao, Santuzzo Salieri. Here's a little graveyard. A little uh, Argonian graveyard. It's actually quite pretty. Underneath a hist. Okay, we did go in here. My memory is shot, as you guys know. Shields. Swords. This must be a whole training section. These are abatis. I don't know if I say that right, but I know how to spell it. Then we're indoors. We've got a little garden over here. Oh, look at the cute little chairs. Mushroom chairs and a mushroom bench. Beautiful. Nice little fountain over here.
art. Hmm. Oh, they split. Oh, it's a little kid plane. The marbles are from that game. And you just sink it down. Oh my god, the little bed in a silt strider shell. It looks like a boat. Little kids living here. Oh, wow, that looks amazing. That looks like it goes. That's beautiful. That actually looks like it goes too. Wow. Toilet. Bidet. Cosmetics, like you said. Soap. That's a combination of a rug and the sixth house table. Little shell soaps. And then we've got a little spot for things for the jacuzzi. Hot tub. It is adorable. It's beautifully made. Black Razor never disappoints. Ooh. They sunk into the desk a map. That's a neat fireplace. More gaming. Mm. This is where it is. The greenhouse. I was wondering. They roofed it in, too, so you don't get rained on. Really good idea. But it lets you go to the next stuff if you want to. Oh, look at that sink. Beautifully done. Oh, that's a portal. In case you want to take a portal to somewhere else. Really beautiful house, Black Razor. I mean, you did a really good job. Super impressed. Uh, I don't think I go went to a neb, did I? Yeah, I did. Okay. Let's go to Tapio's Goranir. Telvani Village. I love Tapio. Yeah. Um... So yeah, I've been searching for houses with <clears throat> pools and hot tubs, because, you know, that's how I roll. And um, because, you know, one of the houses that um, I was looking at my husband told his friend with a big family about and the friend went up there to go actually look at the house because they were thinking about actually moving it, they need a bigger house for the kids and and whatnot and this one while it's a little further away from Madison has everything you could need even backed up to a park you know so the kids could play on the park stuff um, this is Tapio Telgorinir, 600 out of 600. Oh, wow, look at that. Let's go around and then we'll come back. Um, so this friend went and go went and looked at the house and told us that the owners told them that the pool they had, which was a, I mean, it was a decent sized pool, but I never would have guessed said that they priced out getting a pool just like it 
to be uh, built in their new home that they're moving to. And they were quoted $90,000. And so my husband's like, well, maybe we should just look at houses without pools and not really worry about the pool thing. I'm like, you know what? If we can get a $90,000 thing without having to pay $90,000, I think that would be best. So we're going to keep just looking. I mean, we're not in a hurry to move anywhere, so rather have the pool actually exist. This is neat. Broken stuff. A really good combination of, of mushrooms and other things. But let's go up inside. $90,000 for a pool? I've seen... Okay, so when I worked as a lawyer, I did some construction defect work. There was a $100,000 pool that was made out of black granite. And... Yeah, let me switch that for you. And black granite is a fortune and it doesn't do well with salt water and it was it's just uh, it was a total mistake. But the point is is that if you can build a $100,000 pool out of black granite, there's no reason why you can't build an in-ground pool for less than that. It's crazy. Look at how they reskin this entire section yet it still looks Telvani. I think it's the mushrooms. It's just an absurd price, I think. But then again, I haven't built a pool lately. <clears throat> I wonder why the Talvani came here to build their own little tell. I guess just like in um, Solstein. You want to build a tell? You build a tell wherever you want to. You just put the mushrooms down and let them grow. Lots of good clutter. I love these mushrooms on the walls. They look fantastic. All right, let's just make one last loop because I think I might have missed stuff. No, that's blocked off on purpose. Poor Bastion in a cage. It's like... Sadness. Alright, let's go to Rakho Kuhn's control room. A bit unvaded, invaded by unknown space filaments and blue space things, but otherwise functional, although noisy. Snow melt. Cute. All right. Control room. Oh, I see. I see you're supposed to go through the paintings. Got it. I don't think it's quite done yet, though, Sprakukun, unless I don't have the effects. I'm assuming that's what it is, is I don't have the effects. Um... Maris kiss. Although it says storage, I shouldn't have gone to that. I should make, um, I should enter Ouroboros and do a way shrine. Way shrine sounds like it'd be fun to do. All right, what else do we have? Let's let's do um, 
House of the Silent Magnifico. Crazy Vogue. Oh, good. Um, I sent him... Uh, I sent him the complaints from this last month and that included yours. So he must have figured out what was doing it. So it's an, it's now fixed. So that, that is excellent. I'm glad to hear that. Um, I'm on at EU, but we'll go again tomorrow. And we'll check it out. Ooh, they're taking EU down again today or did they already can't tell tonight maybe no thank you uh all right so this is the house is silent magnifico look at all these butterflies oh this is so pretty they put another roof up i wonder why kitchen divided up this house needs dividing. It's it kind of has it with the, the middle st uh, posts, but not fully. So I think this this dividing up is a really good idea. Very uh, red guardian. But we do have a little turtle. See him? Nothing in him, though. This house is a mood. Such a serene place, but... I wouldn't have expected uh, serenity around Boethia, but... Who knows? I hope I didn't miss anything crazy. I mean, I hope I didn't miss anything crazy, Vogue. That sounded weird the way I said it. Alright. Let's go to... Nuts Butts? Let's play A Place to Stay with Your Friends, Hammer Death. I'm a little concerned. Making faces at you guys. This is not going to be a terribly long stream because I'm not well. Thank you so much for the follow, Sad Phantom. Make sure you all enter uh, exclamation point potato if you're on PCNA or EU so you can get entered for 100,000 gold. I give it away every day. Sad Phantom made up for the one follower I lost yesterday for no reason at all. It was very sad. Okay. Oh, wow. Let's Play is a little bit dark. This is this is Hammer, Hammer Death. So, a great place to stay with your friends. I think, um, I think your friends wouldn't be your friend very much longer. Well, they'd be dead. That's funny. Nice Halloween house, too. Alright. And then we've got an exercise. Let's do... Nalos? Klein blooming. I don't know what that means, but hopefully it's not anything dirty that I just said. I'll be a cow. Hey, hey, I'm a cow. And people say a cow around. No? I'm a goofy cow. Ow. Quit it.
load, load, load your boat. Cause you're really dull. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Cause I said so. It doesn't rhyme. Load your boat. Or, hey, hey, we're the monkeys. I don't know why I'm thinking of those things, but it wouldn't surprise me. <laughs> That's weird. Why is it taking so long to load? EU, why do you suck? Okay. Ooh, 400 out of 400. Klein Blooming. Oh, wow. Look at this. This is neat. It's a whole village. Look at the way that the flowers go over that rock like that. This is really good. Nalos. I don't think I know you. They put trees outside this gate. I don't know if that means... I don't know what they did there. But that's neat. Piggy. The piggy fits perfectly here. I love how everything isn't perfect. Like, look at the way the bucket's kind of on its edge. We got a chicken just chilling. And then we're in here. We've got... It's very rustic. Maybe it's the animals that make it feel so rustic. Whoa, where are we going over here? Oh, it's sneaky sneaky for praying to, to this guy. Little flowers, huh? Thank you, Nywin. Go. And then we have a little wallpapered in spot where someone can sleep. Nice view out the back. They covered up the water feature. And then here's a kiln. I'm cooking another bedroom. Built a whole little village. And then another one with skooma. This is really cool. You don't often see uh, really rustic builds. Usually people fancy them up. But this one is, I would say, it's realistic. You know, planks and the choices of what they're using to make things with. Tarps, planks, um, humble things. Look at those. The planter is a, is a barrel. You know, it's just different stuff that they used. Nothing really um, ritzy, but yet it looks like a little town. It's adorable. Nicely done. All right. go to we've seen all these people's stuff that's weird snow melt wait we went to that Oh my goodness, I can't make up my mind. All right, let's go to Private Man Gallery de Joran. All pretty wonders in a Nordic fairy tale. And this will probably be our last house, and then I'll raid off. So make sure you hit exclamation point potato for sure.
because Karen is sick. I got a fever. As usual. It's a uh, rheumatoid arthritis fever. It sucks. makes me not really want to talk all that much so I apologize for that that's what's really going on today is I'm just feeling so shitty that I don't really want to interact all that much no problem I mean I don't want to miss two days in a row that sucks it's really not cool all right let me turn off the private man all right and we got gallery du jour on now this is more than just a gallery I mean it certainly has a gallery in it We've got the stables over here. And then up here we have a little tent with all of the alchemy stuff in it. And then this is the jewelry station. Which makes sense for the snack to be there, actually. Here's the wood. They did everything outside is all crafting, it looks like. This is, um... Of course, the blacksmith over here. And then up here is the kitchen. And here's sewing. They got a little bit of everything, don't they? Oh, die. So they have two die stations in here because that other one was a die station too and that's where you paint. They have the old fashioned die station and the new die station, or outfit station rather. Cal Granted. And a dummy. And an ethereal well. Oh, that's actually a really smart place to put the well. This is a good spot for somebody who wants to do their writs really quickly, you know. Goodness, what is that? I don't know what that is. Let's go look. No. I'm not holding my breath. But maybe one day. What an interesting building. Is this just to make sure it doesn't rain on you? That makes sense. Um, let's see if there's something inside. There is! Good lord, how did you... Uh-oh. Urnscar sort of popped through the floor there. Oh, wow. I can't believe how much they fit in this house. The banker. Is there a merchant in here? Crazy. That's really cool. All right, I'm gonna pull it. Um, but first, but first. Yeah, I don't think we can go up there, though. 
Can we? I mean, I can double check, but I didn't think we could go up there because of the trap door. Hello. I'll double check. Don't want to miss anything in somebody's house and then have them be upset. Um, because I missed something. I just assumed stupidly. Nope, can't get up there. But there does look like there's a second house over here. Oh no, it's just a different way in. Okay, so let's uh, see who's on. We got... We'll do Trippy Tigress. We haven't raided, raided off to her at all. Here we go. It's gonna start it. And then we're gonna pick the winner. The winner is. Zeki! I need your info, Zeki. Like server and and name for that. Let me know. I'll be back tomorrow. Another hundred grand to give away. All right, we're going to raid off to uh, Trippy Tigress and you guys, if you Ziki, you can get a hold of me, you know, in the game. Is that a sock puppet? That's adorable. <laughs> 